Hello, my fellow anti-bottom fighters, and welcome back for more Luxor. Today, we're taking on the extra level of stage number um, five. Oh, yes, he's of the east, and gee, this level looks like an annoyance already. Yeah, take my advice. Extra levels are almost always harder than the uh, normal ones. Okay. Wow, I can see the gimmick of this level. It's very... It has a very unique path. My goodness. There! That was a very nice color bomb that I so sorely needed. Oh man, this is not going well. Extra levels tend to kick my butt. Mainly because it's my first time playing the level, but even then, still. Yeah, come on, come on. Wow, this guy sucks. I mean, look at him. He has a, a very long line of spears that are just the same color, making it easy for me to destroy him. Ah, the lightning is very good for this level, I just realized. Nice. Okay, I'm finally starting to get my, um... My <laughs> niche back. I'm finally... I'm finally getting good again! Yeah! Yeehaw, suckers! Of course I say that, and I didn't get anything done in the time I stopped the spears. Oops, Conus, you boastful show-off! Ah, uh, Pride never pays. Look, you brag, and now you get... wrecked. I do like the look of this level though, it really does look like an Oasis Beach. <laughs> Reverse. The bane of all you spear pushers. That's your new name from now on. Okay, good, good, good. Ah, speed shot! <laughs> I love this one. Wow, a stop. Yeah, as I said, sometimes. Stop isn't slow is better than stop, and it's in cases with very vertical levels. You can get barely anything done in those levels. Wow! Brilliant, just my luck. Uh. Okay, there we go. This, in my personal opinion, the pillar of Os. Osiris is harder than this. Yeah, don't blame me. I really personally find it, uh, this easier. I mean, like, the pillar of Osiris, they had that very long, stupidly hard vertical segment, but here... Here, not too bad. I say not too bad right now, but, uh, watch me fail miserably now. Plus, the Pillar of Osiris is a two-sided level. This seems like a, um... This seems a little, you know, lackluster in comparison. Sorry for the... Sorry for saying bring that up, but... Uh, though, one good thing is I do like the look of this level. Uh, I would like to point it out. Extra life, not bad. Yeah, you need a lot of hand-eye coordination for this sort of games. Ah, really? <laughs> 100%? Well, he's done. Okay, there we go, and that's stage 5 complete, Oasis of the East, done. Okay, now, next off, stage 6, Jenny to the Sphinx, I mean Sphinx. Stage 6, there's one, treading Cleopatra's needle. Now, this stage, uh, or the stage 3 levels in general, as in uh, multiples of 3, they tend to intertwine a lot. As you can see, intertwine below, under, all this sort of stuff. They're the first levels to do so, but they won't be the last. A lot of extra levels later will continue doing the intertwining trick. Just to solely annoy you. <laughs> oh, brother. Now you see it being a pain, the intertwining. Yeah, nice. Got that one. I almost didn't get it. Uh, there's nothing worse than missing a power-up that could save your butt. As I said, the wonderful stuff about 
um, this game in general is that um, is that you have to decide which segment to do in general. You want to avoid line mergers as much as possible because line mergers usually means that your your segment is getting way too long for its own good, or that they are, or that you cannot stop the balls from reaching another one. Which means that you're typically screw if line mergers occur. I have let line mergers occur before in I think 4-3. Wow, that is a horrible place for the new segment to spawn. What a trollish location. Seriously, this song will play 24-7 sooner or later. There we go, speed sort. Uh, that's very needed. Okay, oh my goodness. Okay, this level is starting to annoy me. <laughs> eh, we're not even halfway done with the game yet. And already, it's starting to get annoying. Yeah, you see, there's a line merging going to occur right now, and I do not want it to occur, so you know what, I'm going to get rid of you before you become a threat. See? Oh, brother. Yeah, you don't, although you want to focus on the segment that's the nearest to the pyramid, you also do, do not want to, like, you know, neglect the segments that are away from the pyramid, because sooner or later, if you neglect them, they'll line merge and screw you over. There we go. There, you see, I made that, sec that segment that's headed here shorter than it could have been. It could have been a lot worse, trust me. My goodness. Yeah, you know what? This level is a troll. It's not a nice level. There we go. See? Intertwining. Preventing me from... Intertwining is a troll because they block like the... The segments which you really need to clear. My goodness, I'm sorry if I'm not talking much, trying to concentrate here. There we go. Okay, we're getting awfully close to 100% now. Oh man, I missed that chain. I could have destroyed all of the spears with that chain if I had made it. Okay. There we go. We're getting close to 100%. I really want 100% anytime soon. Now, of course, another new segment shows up. And the blue is useless. Oh, brother. Stupid blue get lost. There we go. Okay, 100%. Thankfully, I needed that. Plus, it doesn't help that there's a stupidly deadly vertical segment here. Verticals will kill you in this game. That's my one line of advice. Verticals kill. There. Okay. 6-1 complete. This level gave me more trouble than I thought. Okay. Day 6-2. Inundation of the Nile. And... This one, in my personal opinion, is not too bad. The only problem with this level is that it starts it starts very high towards the top. Levels which do that tends to be more tricky because you tend to be unable to hit the balls until they're towards the bottom. You tend to miss them when they are near the top. Oh, plus there's a stupid vertical here. Oh brother. You know, I'm starting to uh, the good thing is that if you have speed shots, these sort of levels aren't too bad. The one where they start closer towards the top. Oh my goodness, I didn't even notice it was that close to the pyramid. Oh no. I'm down. Okay, there we go. Good, good. Oh, brother. I don't want to lie much at this time. Okay, slow. I need that, thank you. Oh no, oh no.
Oh no, and it's gonna lie much too. Ugh. See now, see how long the segment is now. Okay, I underestimated this level. I underestimated this level. Oh no, oh no. Ah, come on! Oh, and it's gonna lie much again. Yeah, line mergers aren't good because, um, when you line merge, you basically just make the segment longer. And trust me, you do not want that to happen. Well, stage 6 is a real difficulty spike all of a sudden. Oh my, oh man. There. Thankfully, I need that. Oh. Another line merge. Gee. And it's only gonna get worse. We're not even at the halfway point of the game. Oh, man. Okay, there we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, this is so stressful. I don't think you understand how stressful this is unless you actually played one of these games before. Reverse! That that beats an Ankoin any day. There we go. Okay, I'm at least getting some slack now. Oh, I say that and now look what happened. Get lost, you! Okay, I'm in a good position so far. Oh no, now I'm not. Okay, now I'm in a horrible position. Oh man, that last line... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. That last line had so many spears I nearly couldn't clear in time. Freak the speed shot. Oh no, no. Oh, come on! When can I beat the level already? Stop! I need that. Thank you. Ugh. Nothing beats. Nothing is worse than having a, the wrong color at these kind of games. Sometimes it's just rotten luck. Ugh. Yes! Thank you very much. Ugh. I couldn't even use the fireball! You stupid game! Couldn't have you at least given me that satisfaction? Uh, if you enjoyed this episode of Luxor, do feel free to leave a like or be an anti fighter and subscribe, and next time we're going to take on more of Journey to the Sphinx, Stage 6 3, Path to the Golden Goddess. See you guys then. Next time on Conus Board. See, you're hearing this theme 24-7 now, eh?